Hello everyone, greetings from Chateau Bouffamont. I'm Sarp, your manager here at the Chateau and your host on this Chateau Bouffamont vlog series. Welcome to your house for picture perfect, cozy and warm, in short, the most memorable Christmas gatherings. This year quite being extraordinary, however it might be, the festive season is fast approaching and we're looking forward to celebrating the special occasion. So for this Christmas special Chateau Bouffamont vlog, we prepared for you yet another great video with lots of fun and ways to help you make the most out of the season. We will talk about decorating your home for the Christmas and setting up the dinner table for the years and celebrations. Much different than last year's video, link up here for more inspirations. This year we will transform the entire main dining hall into a Christmas haven. Our main guest and decorator is Akiko Kovacs from Fleurs in Paris. Thanks to her creativity and vision, we will have something special, I'm certain. So let's head inside, say hello to Akiko and let's get this going with that intro. Hello Kiko, welcome to the channel. Hi Sarp, thank you for having me. Thank you for being with us today for this Christmas special edition of the Chateau Bouffemont vlogs. It's very exciting to have you here with us today. What are your inspirations and what's the plan? Today we are going to decorate the Grand Salon. And as the color of the room is green and white, I'm going to use a lot of greenery and neutral colors such as white, beige and gold. And in terms of atmosphere, we are going to create something cozy and intimate, but also elegant because the room is elegant. And also something simple so that we, you can reproduce at home. Uh, we are going to decorate a mantle, a table and a Christmas tree to create the whole atmosphere of Christmas Eve. Awesome, that sounds very exciting and very charming. If you're ready, let's get to work. So for the mantle decoration, I like to use several types of greenery to make it look interesting and also uh, not putting greenery uh, flat but making movement with several types of greenery. And also I love to use a lot of candles because candles can make um, the atmosphere quickly warm. So uh, for the mantle decoration, I put a lot of candles on the bottom. I also love to use a lot of candles on the table. So the second one for Christmas tree, I love to use uh, a lot of ornaments because it looks full and to do that I love to mix sizes and shapes uh, of ornaments because it's always nice to have small ones and big ones and it's, it becomes more interesting so make sure to mix colors and sizes and shapes. My third tip for table decoration at home, I think uh, garlands are easy to do. You can uh, either put just greenery on the table as you want or attach them together if you want the greenery to fall down from the table. We can also use a lot of candles and if you have any dried fruits, uh, you can put around uh, the greenery, it looks nice. So today the base of the tree uh, is very large, so I used a lot of gifts to cover uh, the structure. So the last tip is for Christmas tree decoration. For Christmas tree, I always start with basics. So if you have basic ornament like this one, I would put around the tree at first. 
And then I keep these uh, special ornaments at the end. Make sure to put your ornaments in different heights so that we can create depths. And then you will put these special ornaments at the end so that we can see the most. Thanks for watching this video and thanks to Akiko for all these wonderful tips and suggestions. I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as we did. If so, please give us a good thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, your support is very valuable for us and while you're at it, turn that jingling bell on so you get notified the next time we share a new video. Until then, my friends, I wish you the best, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Let's cross our fingers, this will be a better year than 2020. Until then, see you soon.